Well, here we are. Our wolf's angel is all complete. I've oiled, blackened, and burned on a coating of linseed oil, boiled linseed oil. And this little piece of history has been well, recreated as best as I can. It took a few chunks out of me. See my thumb? Yummy. This chain, when I was cleaning the scale off the chain, wrapped around the, uh, the wire wheel and that sent this hook flying and this hook took a few good chunks out of my thumb but yeah it works <laughs> it works really well so you put the bar across two tree limbs and then you set your meat on these on this hook here and then when the wolf comes up to get a bite of the meat, he instead gets a mouthful of hook. And then he's caught like a fish on a line. And if you'll notice, this chain, these bars and everything, they all work quite well though. They even hold my weight, even in this little tree. I'm 220 pounds and that holds me no problem. So that's really cool. Now, of course, this particular style of, of, of trapping is illegal in most places around the world, at least in, uh, in Canada here, it certainly is not allowed. Good news, uh, I checked with customer, he's not using it uh, for anything other than, uh, what would you call it, display. It's gonna be a display piece. He's not going to actually use it. But if he chose to, this would actually work which is really quite amazing, really quite cool. I'm very happy with how this all turned out. I hope you enjoyed the process. It took me a lot longer and a lot more work than I expected that it would, but I'm very pleased with how it has come out. There's another little piece of history that I've been able to, 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 to recreate. I love that about blacksmithing. I hope you enjoyed and loved watching the process. Thank you all very much. May the force serve you well.